M0FXB USB driver for the Alliance HD1. So you can find it a couple of places. I'll put the links in the description. There's here. If you go to software, and then you'll see down at the bottom here, USB driver download now, or go to Retivis site here, click support. I'll put the link in and click here. So if we click it, you get the zip file. Just click the zip file. Now I can only see something for Windows 7 here. I'm running Windows 10, so, but Windows 7 seems to work fine. Windows 7 here, double click, uh, look for install. This one here, click yes. And, oh yeah, let's remove it because I've, I've already installed it. So let's re, it's uninstalled it. Let's re install it. Click yes, next. Accept next finish. You've now got the USB driver and when you connect your programming cable, which looks like this, has the screwy sort of thread here. Uh, and it will show up in the device manager. Right click here at the bottom left, click device manager and look in ports and you'll see that the, the radio has been connected here. Um, unfortunately, I haven't got the radio. So this is how you get your USB driver for the Alance HD1. Hope this helps. 7.3, all the best. Links in description.